Hey YouTube! Uh, sorry it's been a while since I've actually made a video and uploaded one. Uh, my crummy job had me working really crappy hours to where I would get off work late. And so I was really tired and I couldn't really make any YouTube videos. And then I would have to, I feel like I had to get up early to go to work the next day, every day. And it, it kind of sucked real bad. I'm definitely going to have to make a video about that. Uh, since I no longer worked for that company. Yeah, I uh, actually quit th three days ago. Yeah, three days ago, and then just yesterday I already got a new job. Uh, this baller over here, <laughs> super skilled at everything I do. Yeah, so besides that, uh, I'm definitely going to try to make new YouTube videos and continue posting new material, new stuff, new uh, little funny chat stuff that I do uh, more weekly I want to try I said before like two three every like two three days I would post no one but I'm gonna try to do one weekly now since I don't know where this job's going to take me it's gonna be a new adventure for me uh, but besides that a few weeks ago I went out this is the whole topic of the story now. <laughs> yeah, a few weeks ago, I went out, and I went out with two of my friends, and we went to the bar, and it was all-you-can-drink draft. It was $10, all-you-can-drink. It was all night, but I thought it ended at 11, which, you know, I don't know. I feel like most places in my town ended at 11, so I just kind of figured it ended at 11. And so here I am drinking. I put, you know my favorite music through the jukebox and I, of course I had to put Uptown Funk on because that's my jam and so I was just in there drinking and drinking and drinking until no ends and I think we got there at like 8 I feel like 8 and eventually I ended up looking down at my phone and being like oh crap it's 1030 so at that point I literally started chugging beer down. I felt like I was chugging it from the keg, but I wasn't really. I was just like, grr, 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 as many beers down as fast as I could. Because I was like, I got 30 minutes before I'm, I'm cut off my beer. And then I like, actually pay for my glasses of beer. And I was just like, grr, 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 just one after another. <coughs> and then I choked and died on some dicks. <coughs> I'm just kidding. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> But so forth, you know, here I am drinking a test can of Nettie's beer, and then 11 o'clock hits, and I was like, I'm going to try to get one more. And I went up there, and I it was like, can I have another course? And he was like, you know, this doesn't end at 11. And at that point, I was like, holy crap. Because I knew at that point I was going to be shit-faced in a matter of time. And it happened. It definitely happened. I was super drunk, I was stumbling all over the place, I was talking to strangers, I didn't know, because when I'm drunk, I, I do that, I, I talk to everyone, everyone becomes immediately my friend, and I become like the persuasive god, and everybody just ends up loving me, and then I'll end up like with random people's numbers, young, old, uh, blind, crippled, everyone everyone literally becomes my friend and I'm I'm cool with that though I don't ever text anyone <laughs> that I end up getting their numbers uh, I met like this British guy once at a bar he gave me his number and I never texted him but in my phone his contacts is Mark from the bar because that's what he put it as and I was just like I don't think I'm ever gonna text this guy and I'm sorry Mark from the bar I'm not gonna text you I don't really text anyone these days <laughs> which is I don't, I don't really care. So anyways, I ended up, well, I didn't want to leave the bar because I was drunk. And I, my friend was like, hey, let's go to Taco Bell, Chris. I'll pay it. And I was like, Taco Bell? Oh, that sounds good. So he started getting up and my other friend started getting up. And I was like, wait, we can't leave yet. Because I put money in the jukebox to listen to Uptown Funk because that was my jam. And I was patiently waiting for it. Even when I was drunk, I was waiting for that song to come on. And then it finally came on. And I was just in there jamming out to my favorite song. And then it ended. And I was and I was like, okay, let's go. And I literally walked out of the bar. 
and like left them in there and waited at the truck for them to come. And so they got to the truck and we went to Taco Bell and I was just sitting there in the car and all of a sudden I felt something coming up and I knew what it was. So I immediately did my sign for when I had to puke, which is... And so uh, my friend looked over and he was like, are you okay? And I just nodded my head. And then I put down my finger and I was like, I'm going to step outside for a second. And he's like, where are you going? And I opened the door and <laughs> walked outside. And then all of a sudden, I puked everywhere in the drive-thru. It, it was like coming out. So much of it. It was like a waterfall of Niagara Falls. Just <laughs> all over the drive-thru. That way, like, if the next person that went through the drive-thru... I feel like they would have to drive through all that puke and they might actually get stuck. It was so much. It was, it sounds so gross, but it's so true. And at the time I was puking, they were ordering their food. And so I'm pretty sure the people that, you know, was taking the order was literally hearing in the background, rrr, rrr, and just like hearing someone puke. But you know, I ended up getting back in the car, happy as usual. I ended up getting my soft taco, my bean burrito, my five layer burrito, going home, eating half of the soft taco, and then passing out on the couch with it in my hand. <laughs> Just to wake up two hours later really sad because all my tacos were cold. <laughs> I was like, why? And I was like slowly eating it. <laughs> and then I finally finished all my food and like really passed out. Uh, yeah, it was, it was a pretty good night. I enjoyed it. To the Taco Bell drive-thru, or the Taco Bell store that, you know, I puked all at, I'm really sorry that you guys had to clean up all that puke, unless you didn't, and you just, you know, waited for a rainy day to occur, like, you know, today. Uh, I'm really sorry that I puked in a drive-thru. I really am. I'm just kidding, I'm not really sorry. Uh, I was drunk at the time, so I really didn't give a shit. Or am I just joking? <laughs> but yeah, uh, that was my Taco Bell drive through experience. Well, Taco Bell throw-up experience, I guess. Uh, I'm definitely going to try to make some more videos of, you know, my life situations and funny things that go around. Uh, check out my other videos and whatnot. My... YouTube ad parody Lamborghini guy. I said that all wrong. That's actually getting a lot of views. I'm really glad you guys are watching it and liking it. Thank you so much. You know, hit the subscribe button if you can. You know, all the subscribers would be really nice. <laughs> but yeah, until next time, YouTube. <laughs>